That's because I just do whatever the fuck I want and I don't care. There you go. As Wookie said, folks, he is the true goth. I don't have a f ack. <laughs> I knew you forgot about the raptor. <laughs> he jumped. <laughs> I, I don't have a fashion sense. <laughs> and I don't fit into any boxes. So I am the last true goth. Yeah. Yeah, unfortunately, uh, the boxes they fit into, the, you know, you, you've got to have plastic trousers. Everybody likes plastic trousers for some reason. Squeaky pants. Squeaky pants. Squeaky pants. Oh, fuck, we'll be to Nozzy here later. Hmm? We have to fight that Nosferatu here later. What Nosferatu? I can't remember now, but I remember there was a Nosferatu. Where? Not now, but like in that hall much later on. When? <laughs> when it actually happens, I'll point it out and you'll tell me it's a different building. It's obviously because I've never fought anything but humans in this establishment. Maybe that was in Chinatown. But it was a big open hall like that. Oh, gold. <laughs> yeah. That ain't helping us. Without the hacking skills, shouldn't there be, like, clues around? There depends on the item. There is a person in there. Yeah. Making plup plup noises. All hail the great lord plup plup. Everything is plop plop. There's no nos. I'm thinking about this Nosferatu you're talking about in a big hall here. I remember he had like lightning. Well, not lightning, but he had an ability that made like lightning looking stuff on his hands. And he had a black. That was the hotel, and that's the um, Sabat Mage character. You attack, you fight him before you fight the Tsumitsi. Yes, it is. I remember a Nazi. You're getting your brain confused as usual. You're putting five and five together and coming up with 307. 307 is a good number, goddammit. He attacked me. He's fair game. Five. Well, the crew never said no death. Right. We have a stick. Yeah, what we need is a stick. Your stick. All the ladies need my stick. I look forward to when we get to these places that Wookie's talking about, and then he goes, Oh my god, it's that place! No, it's not. <laughs> Something totally different, Wookie. Isn't that where? No. Are you sure about it? Mm -hmm. The last time I played this property was 2008. So my memory is a little fuzzy. Oops. Two, three, four. <laughs> Dude, you're the exact same fucking god from the hospital. You get around. We're all the same god from the hospital. Smashy, smashy! <laughs> oh my god, no! Would you die quietly? Jesus! <laughs> Wookie tells him to die quietly and they make twice as much bloody noise. We're not doing very well at this. Apparently not. But we're not dead. I mean, yes, Lecrae's gonna fuck the shit out of us later on, but we're not dead yet. Oh, 
just remembered you get that thing with all the tests. There's so much to this game. <laughs> you mean the, um, how was his name now? Markavian? Maravindian or something? That was the Matrix. But yes, the Asian guy puts you through test chambers. <laughs> now that, right there is a fetish I can get behind. Asian guy puts you through test chambers, part one. the key. We told LaCroix we don't need the key. No, the key to here. I'm sure we just picked it up. That's a watch. Apparently not. It's going to turn to a wholesale slaughter. We do not have the key. The door is locked. Tee hee. Where is it then? Where did we leave it? In our independence. Mm, standard. Wibble. Maybe it's that thing. <laughs> he runs away. Some white guy just beat me with an arm. That's a baton. Let us use the computer! <laughs> it doesn't help. Do we even have any levels of hacking? We're on hacking level one. Nice. Remember? I knew it was low, I just couldn't remember if we'd actually ever put anything into it. <laughs> well, the meal runs away. Fast food. <laughs> I like the thrill of the chase. Isn't it upstairs? Fuck, dude, I don't remember. Let's oh. look in some <laughs> Things. Apparently so. Hey, another baton. Another baton. And a pistol that we don't use. Even though we probably should. The we key! <laughs> now we can make progress. Doesn't matter, we've killed 50% of the people in this building. And we've been caught on every camera. Minor technicality. Yeah, I like LaCroix's face. LaCroix can suck it. He does. Probably sucks on the big black fella's one. Oops! That's not the sarcophagus. I can't understand why someone would go through the trouble of stealing a box with any ancient power. This city is not that dull. Tell me about it, Becky. <laughs> the Becky with the good hair. <laughs> I'm an archaeologist, so I thought I'd indulge in a quick study of this uncommon sarcophagus everyone's so riled up about. My guess, from what I've read about it, is that it's a mummified Mesopotamian king. I needed confirmation. True. <laughs> oh, I really wish I had. All this stuff is containing an antiquarian <laughs> and being a portent of Gehenna is making me cringe. These are the kinds of ridiculous superstitions. Well, making me cringe. Gehenna. Uh. One. Our 
Armageddon, Doomsday, the end of all kindred. It's a common facet of most mythologies. The fear that the world will end. Many believe Cain and the Antediluvians will return. You spelled anticipation. And destroy all kindred. I wholeheartedly disagree. One. What did you say, anticipation? No. He, he said people fear the end of the world. I said you must spell anticipation. Why does he remind me of Lord Dark Elf? I guess he does kind of if so he has take, black hair. Take the glasses off. Well, he does. This is black now. Oh, well, he goes between black and brown. He's had them both. I thought he was blonde. No, that's why we call him Eric the Red, because he has red hair. Sort of ah. a reddy, blonde, brown, mongrel haircut. Okay, one. Cain is the biblical well, first here's some sort of Germanic Nordic person. City, Enoch, a place where kindred and kind coexisted. I believe Cain's a figure concocted to personify the transition from nomadic society to a grave. But she drove society. me here. That myth. Well, well, there we go. <laughs> he, he, he took us from an agrarian society to a modern society <laughs> via the medium of a taxi cab. <laughs> Number two. As I said, Cain in the taxi. Cain likes to drive. How do you get his driver's license? But it doesn't take a supernatural act. To cause widespread of steel humans in his eye are just as capable of managing their own destruction Two. as a deity. A self-realized Gehenna warrants more vigilance than a god-induced one, don't you agree? Such is my argument, which so frequently falls on deaf ears. Oh, don't let me interrupt your progress, if indeed you've made some. My reason for being here is probably being bid on as we speak. Someone is certainly going to be surprised when they find out they've just paid a kingly sum for a desiccated old corpse. Three. Like, share, subscribe. See you.